In Georgia, the fight over face masks is headed to court. Brian Kemp suing Atlanta Mayor Keisha Lance Bottoms in an effort to block the city from making face coverings mandatory and from rolling back reopening measures. In the 124-page lawsuit filed by the state attorney general, Kemp calls Atlanta's mask mandate unenforceable, saying the mayor's statements create ambiguity and uncertainty. The governor asks the court to block the mayor from issuing any future executive orders that are more restrictive than what he has put in place. Unless Mayor Bottoms is restrained, the lawsuit reads, Georgia citizens will suffer immediate and irreparable harm. What the scientists are telling us is that the right thing to do is to wear a mask. In a virtual news conference hours before the lawsuit became public, Mayor Bottoms said she was not at all concerned about potential litigation. I am not afraid of the city. Uh, being sued and I'll put our policies up against anyone's any day of the week. Later, a defiant response to the lawsuit. The mayor writing, if being sued by the state is what it takes to save lives in Atlanta, then we will see them in court. In a tweet of his own, the governor said his lawsuit was for Atlanta business owners and their hardworking employees who are struggling to survive. This latest escalation comes a day after Governor Kemp, who has refused to require masks statewide, blocked cities and counties from enacting their own mask mandates. The move setting up a showdown with some local leaders. I have been absolutely flabbergasted uh, by what has occurred here. Our governor has chosen and continuously chosen to make a public health emergency into some type of political issue. Amid the back and forth, Georgia's COVID-19 cases continue to rise. Thursday, the state added more than 3,400 new cases among the highest single day totals since the start of the pandemic.